Have you seen Jerry or Dakota? We're all going out for a hack together. Sorry, but I refuse to even acknowledge Montana, Wyoming until she apologizes. For what? She thought I was a stable hand. Can you believe it? <laughs> I'm sure it was an honest mistake. Oh, really? Well, she's off hacking with Jerry right now. Alone. What? No, that can't be right. They wouldn't go without me. Believe what you want. But I saw her and Jerry tacking up with my very own eyes. I saw them too, actually. They headed out about an hour ago. Good work, Wendy. Thanks. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, why didn't you guys wait for me? W what do you mean? I thought that you couldn't go this week. Why would you think that? <gasps> Did I mess up? I thought you said you had too much to do. I'm so sorry. I must have misunderstood. It's okay. We'll do it next week at our usual time, right? Sure. Great. Come on, let's go on tech. You don't actually buy that lame excuse, do you? She misunderstood. It happens. Snap out of it, okay? She's moving in on Jerry. You really think so? Big time. Question is, what are you going to do about it? A showmanship horse should walk, turn, stop, and back up according to its handler's cues. Looking good, Wendy. You're applying too much pressure. Dixie's head should be relaxed and straight while you're turning. Here's an example of a handler's lack of control. Don't worry, I've got this. And that, my friends, is what is known as cutting. That was amazing. Very impressive. Okay, okay. Wasn't that impressive? That's kind of rude, don't you think? <laughs> I'd like to see you try it. No problem. Think it's easy, do you? No, but Dixie's a great western horse, and I'm a good rider. How good? Think you can beat me in tomorrow's barrel race? Do you mean for real? I sure do. It's just supposed to be a friendly competition. Who cares? I know I can beat you. Why don't you two make it even more interesting? How? The winner gets a prize. I'll put my championship hat on the line. <gasps> uh, I'm not sure what to bet. Uh, what about your new bridal, Wendy? Christian? I'm game if you are. Wendy, no! What's wrong, Thorburn? Lost your nerve? No way. I accept. Wendy. Dakota's posted faster than that. So have you. I don't know what I was thinking, Bianca. How could I risk losing the hackamore in a stupid bet? Jealousy. I guess. I mean, 
Dakota has been all over Jerry since she got here. He's one of my best friends, not hers. Oh, come on, Wendy. Admit it. You like him, and not just as a friend. <sighs> okay. Maybe I do. But it doesn't matter. Why not? Because he doesn't feel the same way about me. He's completely into Dakota. <sighs> All I can do now is try and beat her in the ring. Flawless showmanship routine. You were great, girl. Nice job, Wendy. You were in total control. Thanks. Now, watch this. And here's what you've all been waiting for. Western Junior Champion, Dakota Montana, and her aptly named horse, Champion. Woo! Good work. You two do make a great team. Now, I have to check to see that everything's running smoothly. He's right. You were amazing. Thanks. I owe it all to this girl. <laughs> this will do. It's not like there's going to be anything interesting to watch. Well... Oh. Right. I'm a bit thirsty. That's a sliding stop straight into a rollback, folks. Free fail! No way, Vanessa. I'll completely miss Dakota's... from Dakota and Champion. And now, we're gonna move right to the big event, the barrel racing. Anything else, your highness? Like this is my fault? Dakota and Champion look like they're gonna post an impressive time. And it's a time of 14.38 seconds. Good luck beating that. And our final contestant is Rose Valley's own Wendy Thorburn on Dixie. And they're off. Go, Wendy, go! And they're neck and neck with Dakota's time. been faking the whole time. Dig in, girl. It's going to be a close one. And what a race, bull. Wendy and Dixie just missed it by a heartbeat with a time of 14.39 seconds. Let's hear it for our winners, Dakota and Champions. Great race, Wendy. <sighs> this is yours now. You won it fair and square. Thanks. I think it's going to look terrific on Champion. I'm sure it will. By the way, you're a trooper. I, I really mean that. Thanks for inviting me to Rose Valley. Looks like you've got your work cut out for you. My arm really did hurt. 
At least at the beginning. And anyway, I thought you'd like spending some quality time with me. Enough. The first thing on the list is walking patch. Aww. Ah! Ugh. Ew! Stop it! Stop! You were great out there, girl. I'm really proud of you. And I'm proud of you, Wendy. You put on quite a show today. Well, you shouldn't be proud. I did something terrible. It's about the hackamore. I... I... lost it, Dad. Here you go. I got it back for you. How? I agreed to go on a date with Dakota. Uh... I'm not quite sure what's going on, so I'll leave you two to talk. I did it for you. I don't get it. Wouldn't you like to go out with Dakota? Not really. Don't get me wrong, I admire her riding, but I'm not into... her. She kind of talks about herself a lot. On that hack, I couldn't get a word in. I'll probably get stuck watching DVDs of all of her championship performances. <laughs> Lucky you. <sighs> I guess you're worth it. Besides, now you owe me. <laughs> Big time. Go out with me. Speak up, we can't hear you. Um, would you go out with me? Only if you dare me. I dare you. I triple dog dare you to go out on a date with me. I accept that dare. Yes! <laughs> Let's go to the next cartoon.